today we thought we'd explore a little bit of Billings. First stop, Lake Elmo State Park. Which is a lake. It's a lake. It's supposed to be pretty. Mainly a lake. And it's a beautiful day, so why not go take a walk? That's right. at my cell phone pedometer before we came out here and as of about 1 p.m. today I had like 14 steps what a fat lazy <sighs> bum I was today I think I think I had a little bit more than 14 steps but we didn't really do anything this morning so we've decided to walk completely around the lake rather than just coming out to see it and then going to see something else. Hi. <laughs> and Steve Death. All this crap, this Cotton cottonwood. Wood. I am deathly allergic to cottonwood. Back in Longmont, I don't think we showed you this either. We biked back one evening from something we were doing and we just biked all through this blowing cottonwood. And I don't think I've had an allergic reaction in my eyes as bad as that time. They were red, they were like watery. It was like I was crying, but I wasn't. Well, I really, I guess I was, but I wasn't because it was so, unbearably uncomfortable to have swollen eyes and itchy and uh, it wasn't it wasn't it wasn't good Not at the lake anymore. No, we're downtown. We're downtown Billings in one of the cute little historic areas. We're gonna walk around and see some stuff, but uh, walking around the lake was fun. Yes, it was. Hot though. Hot, beautiful lake. So walk around, see downtown, and then uh, hit a brewery. Yeah. All along the railway here, you see little signs on this fence, and each one gives you a little tidbit of history and, and information about the area. This one, how Billings got its news. This one, the Northern Cheyenne Tribe. Billings Chinatown, who knew. Of course, the Battle of Little Bighorn. Fight or flight. And it just keeps going. And best of all, why it's called Billings. For Frederick Billings. Let's me present to you Frederick Billings. 
handsome enough dude. This is awesome. This is the first time I've ever seen this. This is a community hops harvest fence. So those vines you were seeing with all those signs are actually Chinook. I think that's how you say it, a type of hop. And Billings has a slew of breweries. We're gonna be going to Thirsty Street here in a few minutes, but check out all of these breweries here in Billings. And in the fall, people will come and volunteer to pick the hops off the fence, whether it be the Chinook, which is that way, or the Sterling, which is that way. And then these breweries will use them. How cool is that? What a cool community way to support local breweries and microbrews. That is just really cool. So now when you drink your Thirsty Street beer, you're gonna know that the hops came from right here, Steve. Yes, Courtney, but I don't, I don't, I don't drink hops. There's hops in all beer. Yes, there is. That adds the alcohol. Yeah. I just don't like a lot of hops. But. But it's cool that the hops are grown right here. Thirsty Street is gonna be that stuff down there. That stuff. Hey dogs. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Let's show everybody how excited you are. Come here, Pence. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Oh we gotta no. See, you got the whole family. We got him. Sit. Penny, sit. Penny, sit. Penny. It smells like dog Penny, in here. Penny, sit. Penny. Oh, kisses. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. The okay, was fun. the brewery was fun. I wasn't a huge fan of the bartender because she wasn't very talkative, but the beers were good. I liked the honey wheat the best. They also had a nitro. The nitro was good too. Yeah. You took off my shades. They had some wine and then tell them the most exciting part. Pricing. Pricing. They had $3 pints mm -hmm. for happy hour. I don't think I've seen that even in Oregon. Yeah where you could get beer almost free. <laughs> so $3 pints is great. And this one tried a sour. And she might start looking for sour beers in the future. Maybe. Maybe so we'll that's also exciting. Mm -hmm. as far so as we had I'm fun concerned. exploring Billings. And uh, now I think we're gonna hang out with our friends. We're back and so back in their driveway. We're gonna hang out with them and have some dinner. That's right. And uh, yeah, see what goes from there. But uh, we'll take you on our next adventure for sure. Tomorrow. Tomorrow or the next day or something. We don't really know. Yeah. Things aren't planned. Sometimes. Soon. But that's good. <laughs> Sometime soon. <laughs> Sometime soon. So, hope you enjoyed this look at some of what Billings has to offer. It's kind of a cool town. And uh, we'll see you next time. Yep, bye. Bye guys.